Hello everyone! Before I start the gameplay, I'm going to show you the sliders that I missed. I missed a few. So here's the ears point one that I showed you guys. Here's the ears orbit, which flips the ears like up and down, it looks like. That's so cool. And then we have a jaw underbite one. Thank goodness for the Sims 3 wiki or I never would have figured out about this. <laughs> Found out. And it goes like back and forth so that your sims look a little bit more angry, I assume. Because uh, he kind of does look angry like that. Especially with this eyebrow one, which I actually did show you guys, but now it looks like a lot more intense. <laughs> and then last but not least, we have the new nostril slider. And I think it's this one. Where the they flare and then they also go out. So how, how insane does that look? That's so cool. So I just wanted to make sure that I showed you guys before I completely forgot about it. And now let's get back to the gameplay. Or let's start the gameplay, the very first episode of gameplay. So I've already chosen their home, but right now there are, I think there are about five homes. There's an affordable elegance in the middle. This one over here, top left, which is a comfortable classic. And down here we have a couple that are a little bit smaller, a stately starter, and a cozy retreat. And I believe that is all the starter homes as of right now that I can see. None over here in this area. And this is the one that I'm moving them into. It's called the Craftsman Mansion. And it has two bedrooms and is the only one that will fit all four of them, including all the items that they need and stuff. So I've been doing I've been doing a little research on the Sims 3 wiki. <laughs> it's very helpful actually. I didn't do too much research because I didn't want to like spoil everything. But um oh look it's a full moon tonight. I've also set it so that the full moon comes every two days, but it's not going to stay like that forever. I just wanted to make Make sure that I was able to show you uh, like what happens during a full moon oh look different different things oh what what happened to him he's not a werewolf anymore oh why not what oh there we go there we go there she's a fairy he's a werewolf I was like how come he doesn't get a cool little square around him so brown means werewolf green means fairy gold means witch and then of course the purpley pink one means vampire I'm going to go get them jobs right now and then I'm going to decorate their home because they really need it so since she's a very friendly person I decided that she can get a job in the education career Jake will get a job let's see maybe the military or sports career I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking sports career. Where's sports career? Oh, it was over here at the same place. Duh. <laughs> Stadium, join professional <coughs> sports career. I'm going to have Cal be a, a writer because we need somebody to stay at home. Like he needs to stay at home. And I've also made him artistic and a bookworm. So that'll come in handy anyway. So I'm going to have him visit the library, which is all the way over here. Visit what? Library of Lore and Vault of Antiquity. That's cool. <laughs> Gabby Gallo will join the alchemist career. Or not alchemist. We can't do that yet. That's, um, I think that's like a profession. I think you can sell your own things. So where's the fortune teller one? I have no idea where it is. Ah, uh, um, where is it? Is that it? It looks new. Gypsy wagon. Oh, join fortune teller career. Is this a rabbit hole? I hope it's not a rabbit hole. Oh no, I think it is. It doesn't give you an option to look inside. Alright, well that's fine. So while they're doing that, I'm going to go ahead and go into buy mode and purchase some different beds because there's no way they're all going to share a bed. I'm going to get a vampire bed too. They have a new one. Thank goodness. Let me see if I can afford it first of all. Uh, right here. Beds. It's really, it's so much different than the regular vampire bed. Oh, here we go. Altar bed. Look at how cool that looks. Oh, wow, I've spent, like, all of my money. I don't know if I should be doing that right away. Okay, maybe I, should, maybe I can't afford it right now. Uh, so I'll just have him sleep on this bed. Why not? Him and his brother can share the same type of bed. Not share, but you know what I mean. And then over here, we have a fairy, a little fairy house that fairies can sleep in. So I'm actually going to get her the fairy one. And why does that one have a, a horse on it? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, also, I've turned off pets and horses and celebrities because I don't want to be overwhelmed with, like, all the different expansion pack stuff. And I think it would be better if I just kept it simple. Nah, okay, whatever. Why not? I'll change all of these later once I get more money. But 3000 that's not going to go a long way. We need the pea shooter for zombies tonight. I mean, it's going to be pretty intense. It's going to be very intense, actually. I have no idea where... Is it in here? 
supernatural fairy den or what is the fairy thing called fairy home uh where is it I could have sworn it was in this section I could be wrong I could be wrong. oh no it's right here so we have the fairy bungalow for 475 simoleons Ooh, and it lights up and this one is the fairy castle and it's a little bit too big is it I don't know I like the fairy bungalow I think it looks more more fairy ish if that's even a word I don't even think that's a word <laughs> and uh, uh I think I think that's it that's all I need oh no she needs an alchemy table thingamajiggy I'm gonna delete that and put that over here I looked at this I looked at all of the the items that you can get because I'm making that objects video so I have everything oh no where is it oh it's in the hobbies and skills duh Nicole duh. right here Alistair's alchemy I can't put it right there um, I'm pressing and holding alt key by the way to place it precisely where I want it oh and we also need a bookshelf Woo! this is this is gonna be intense this is gonna be crazy the pea shooter by the way if you get the limited edition uh, it comes with the pea shooter and it's very handy they'll kill the zombies for you here it is pea shooter wow that's pretty crazy so where do I put it where can I put it can I put it up here no I'll put it I'll put it right there and I also have a walnut from I'm not sure if it's registered no I think it's from pre-ordering it you get a lamp and something I'll show you guys all of those items in the objects video which will be tomorrow hopefully I'm hoping I've been working really hard on it I hope you guys enjoy it guys I hope you guys enjoy it <laughs> the walnut prevents the zombies from like um, killing you instantly so it's, it's very useful look at the pea shooter is it doing its little dance oh it is that is so cute that's too cute so what else is there to do I think I think we're good for now I'm going to have her go do that oh she's flying her broom she's flying her broom oh what is this this is how much magic power your sim has remaining nice and I can't believe it's a full moon already that's, that's pretty crazy that is so cool does she have a wand too she has a wand it's a classic wand we're gonna have to upgrade her uh, meet a vampire why not learn alchemy skill of course you can learn alchemy skill join political career no you're going to be a writer perform a stunt show for tips how do you do that learn alchemy skill uh, where is your broom how well it's in her inventory isn't it no where's her broom at she doesn't have a broom I should get her one except career you're doing that you're no that's not going to happen congratulations Gabby just got a new job Gabby needs to be at the gypsy wagon at 1 p.m. on Monday Gabby's boss is Rufus Clum. That's an awesome name. Rufus Clum. Having a good relationship with your boss never hurts. And you're going to be working for the education place. She got a new job. Everglow Academy and Coliseum. Oh, that's pretty. Pappy Wolf. Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> that sounded like a weird howl. <laughs> I don't know consider the hollowness of life no don't be negative come on I didn't realize that brooding was gonna be so bad but I mean I, I guess it's okay which is which is I don't know are they depressed I don't even know so what are you reading you're reading true fairy tales <laughs> I like that man this is you know what this is probably my favorite expansion pack <gasps> I don't know yet so far it's getting good it's getting good um reviews from me Oh, are these the are these the bookshelf doors? I don't know. Oh, can you go downstairs in here? What the hell? What? Where is it? Oh, cool. Can you open any of these? No. Where is it? You how come you can't open any of them? Is this one? Can you open this one? Oh, <gasps> this is a trap door. Inspect bookcase. Hell yeah. So he's going to gain one skill in writing, and then I'm just going to have him join the writing profession. And you're going to finish a book, don't worry. Acquire vampiric sunscreen. There's a specific elixir that keeps running through your sim's head. There will be no satisfaction until your sim can acquire it. How do you do that? How do you do that? Okay, let's do this one. I'm guessing she has to make one, Gabby. Gabby's going to be very useful, I have a feeling. 
And no, not that. What are you doing? Lana is talking to Jake by an alchemy stick. Are you kidding me? I just bought one. Woohoo in the fairy house with who? A throw party. Maybe later. Maybe later. Oh, look at this moonlit. Wow, a werewolf. So that was a real werewolf. Cool. It was everything Lana expected except bigger teeth. That's so cute. You live with him, Thork. Maybe they could be friends. I want her to be friends with everybody. Because, I don't know, she just she's such a friendly person, I can tell. She's going to be awesome. Ooh, rock, paper, scissors. Uh, let's actually see that. Rock, paper, scissors, come on. I read that on the Sims wiki that that's a new interaction that you can do, so that's pretty cool. Kyle's a bookworm, which means he can read faster than other Sims. Where are you going? <laughs> let's watch them. Uh, his boss is David Musgrave. And I read that one. Oh, come on! Did you see that? That's what he did. <laughs> a werewolf. A werewolf! Oh, look, her boss is a witch. That's cool. I, I mean, a werewolf. <gasps> Pappy wolf. Oh, yeah, duh. The Goulds, I think, are the... Hey! Hey, 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 hey! No, 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 no! You have to be nice to her. Come on. Apologize, you jerk. Friendly. Apologize. Gosh. Why are you being such a biatch? Mm -hmm. Ask about day. We Funny. Joke about bumps. shedding. Okay, you make silly face. Us. Joke about Skip shedding. Alright, so, Gabby. Let's let's pay attention to Gabby. Let's get her broomstick if we can afford one. Hopefully we can. If not, I'm just going to sell some stuff. Because if I feel like there's so much stuff in this house. Vehicles. Where do I, where do I go? Miscellaneous. Magic broom stand. Oh, cool. We could put it anywhere. I'm going to put it in here put it in their rooms and a zoom sweeper junior zoom sweeper classic neo classic wow we're kind of broke so i don't want to spend too much money and then where are the wands it would be great to get her a new wand Ar argent argent spell accuracy low 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 wow <laughs> it's gonna take us a while to afford anything good so there we go. That's her broom. Make preferred vehicle. Yes. I like that they have brooms in this. That's amazing. That's amazing. So I have to get everybody home before the zombies attack and they kill us all. Let's research alchemy. <laughs> that would be so scary. I would feel so bad. So are you going to learn the skill yet or what, foo? Are you almost done? I think he's probably almost done. Too bad it's not nighttime. Actually, I'm glad it's not nighttime. Man, it's going to be really intense. I hope we survive. I hope everybody survives. I want to see a zombie so bad, though, and I want to see him transform into a wolf. I think it would be pretty cool, actually. So who's doing something that I would like to see? I want you guys to become friends. If she doesn't become friends with everyone, I'll, I'll probably be, like, really sad. Play tag with werewolf. Get to know. Friendly. Ask about alma mater. Brag about... No. Enthuse about hunting. How does he hunt? Does he have to hunt when he's in werewolf form? Playful pester. What's that? Um, tell a fairy tale. Aw, oh, a fairy tale. Talk about flowers. Sure, why not? Ask about alma mater. Screw that. Enthuse about hunting. No, let's do playful pester. What does that look like? I hope it's not mean. Like, you know how some things are, are friendly, but they end up being, like, mean? Like, bragging and boasting? I think that's mean. Oh my gosh! She's like, she's like Navi. That's how you say, is it like the navigation fairy from Zelda, right? That's so cute. She's a fairy. She's a fairy. Aww, I like it. They're friends. Thank goodness. Okay. And then we're going to enthuse about hunting. Alright. So, you. You have learned the writing skill. And I'm actually going to have you um, investigate this, this strange door over here. This strange bookcase. I mean. Oh, cool. Look at those lights. The candelabra type of things. I don't even think that's what they're called. Is it? I don't know. It's almost nighttime. It's almost getting to dark time. <laughs> I think darkness starts at like 6. 30. 5. 30. What? Well, open it. Oh, open door. Haha. <laughs> Duh. What is this? Neighborhood Grillathon? Nobody wants to do that. What the hell? 
He's getting- Oh, she learned Vial of Bliss. What is that? Gabby has taken the first step into the mystical, magical world of alchemy. There are lots of elixirs to create, each with their own unique power to transform a sim's life. But those elixirs won't mix by themselves, so get cracking. Hey, it's a, a TARDIS? Wait, what's it called? Um, from Doctor Who? I don't know. I, I'm really... Oh, check Lunar Horoscope. Sure. Check Lunar Horoscope. Sure. That's a cool bookshelf. Oh, that's kind of creepy, actually. What the heck? Ah, stop moving. Stop moving, camera. And, um... Oh, more. No. Turn that on. Oh, cool. Hey! What are you doing, Capricorn? Today the moon indicates a possibility of romance for Call Heron. Why are you blue? Why did you turn blue? Cal feels as blue... What? Cal feels as blue as a deep blue. <laughs> Empty. Meaningless. See? Even though he's, like, kind of happy. Turn off. Turn on. Turn off. What is that? I don't even remember what that is. Okay, so you're going to join the... Uh, what is it? Where is it? More self-employed writer. There you go. And you're being amusing. You guys can be besties, right? That's, that's, I think, that would be a good choice. And let's, um, special, charismatic, admire. Oh, hey, I like that. Charismatic, comp, tell, <laughs> tell dramatic story. Okay. Now let's go back to Gabby and see what the hell she's doing. Oh, look what she acquired. A whole bunch of stuff. I can hear somebody growling outside. I mean, not somebody, but like an animal. So creepy. Um, so... What else is there? Oh, f butterflies! Fairies! What? <gasps> Look! Oh, wh uh, pause it. I don't want them to disappear. Look at all this stuff! Oh, crap. That's a lot of stuff. Collect, collect. A mushroom. Oh, it's a plant. Talk to plant. What the hell is this? A uh, air conditioning system? Well, that's nice. They they needed to add something that actually looked like an air conditioning system instead of just vents. So random. And like big old tubey things. You know what I'm talking about? Many imagine the romance of a career in writing, but few can bear the isolation and discipline it takes to be great. Time to dust off the laptop. Laptop. Fill up a giant cup, a uh, coffee mug, and get writing. A few dinky hours a day might cut it for a hobbyist, but you're a professional writer now, and your publishers expect tomes of inspired prose. She cut a monarch butterfly for $9. And you can come on home. You're gonna burn. I don't even know why you're not burning right now. Oh, you're probably inside. That's why. Gabby just caught a red admiral butterfly. Valued at 39. Nice. 16 iron. What the hell? Moonstone. <gasps> a moonstone. Oh, high five if you know. Well, you probably don't know what I'm talking about. A gem dust. What, sh what would be better? Gem dust or getting it cut into something? Let me know. Let me know. I assume that getting it cut would be better because it's more expensive and usually that means you'll get more in return. Um, but I don't know. Write a magic broom. Acquire an elixir. Create an elixir. So let's see if we can do any of those. Mix an elixir. Um, I guess. Research alchemy. Maybe we should do that a little bit more and then do that. Then a... The mix and elixir. All right. Oh, well-known fact: vampires. Yep, yep, yep. I told you. I told you. Visit a graveyard. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Stop. Stop with all these. Visit a graveyard during a full moon. Oh, we can do that tonight. We can totally do that tonight. Ride a magic broom. I guess everybody wants to ride a broom. Maybe I should get everybody a broom. Meet a werewolf. What the hell is that? That little symbol. That's weird. Okay, come on, Jake. You might as well come home. It could be dangerous out there by yourself. We need to wear ward off uh, zombies. We can't have you die on the first day. That would just that would suck. Recipe for ad nauseum. Ah, nauseum. What? Vial of bliss. Mmm. Let's do vial of bliss. Sounds cool. Although, that was like uh, what's the magical book that opens by itself? Ugh, it's not the one from Charmed, and it's not the one from Harry Potter. I don't know. Is it from Charmed? <laughs> I don't know. He needs to learn an athletic skill, so you might as well. You might as well. Workout cardio. 
Gardening. Nah, you don't have to learn gardening right now. You are friends with her. Oh. You're not friends with her anymore? What the hell did you do, jerk? You being rude to her? That's really mean, you know. Okay, now. Is she making it? Is she doing a good job? Oh, look, her skill is going up fairly quickly. Gabby has just improved her alchemy skill to level 2. Gabby is getting quicker at mixing up alchemic concoctions. What does that look like? Ooh, it's boiling. Boil, toil and trouble, boil and bubble? Or <laughs> what's the phrase? I don't know. That looks so cool. I like this station. If they had this in real life, if alchemy was a real thing, that would be amazing. <gasps> did she successfully create it? A vial of bliss. She did. We should drink it. Let's drink it right now. Uh, drink elixir. Throw elixir at a sim. Nah, let's drink it. Let's be selfish and drink it. The for oh no, the foreboding full moon begins its mystical ascent into the night sky. Oh crap, crap, crap. Everybody get home now. Get home now. Transform from werewolf. Oh shiznit. Let's watch him do that. I think that'd be a little bit more entertaining. Well, let's watch both. So what did she get from that? In bliss. A shot of liquid that makes you forget all your troubles. Who knew? Alright. Alright, it's time. It's time. Jake is going to transform for the first time because it's a full moon. I'm going to have Cal go out to the graveyard and it's going to be amazing. Holy crap. Oh, he's scary. Oh, shit, isn't it? Feral change. Rawr. Sometimes it it just can't be helped. The wolf has to come out from werewolf transformation. Transformation. So can he actually hunt? I'm afraid for zombies. I'm so scared right now. Yeah. I don't want him to die, but I, I want him to hunt. Hunt solo. Alright, hopefully he doesn't die. Let's see what he does. And the fairy. Where are you, Lana? Lana, get your ass home now. You crazy? God. Um. Oops, hold on. Hold on for a second. I gotta answer that. Sorry about that. I had to call somebody. So while I was on the phone, I changed the rooms. I switched them over. I put her alchemy station inside her room just so she doesn't have to keep coming out here in case of a zombie attack. And also I put the fairies, uh, Laura's little fairy den in here. I don't know what it's called. Fairy house? <laughs> I don't know. So Lana, I mean, is on her way home. Jake is over here hunting his little brains out. Hopefully he finds something good. And Cal is actually on his way to the graveyard right now so we're going to follow him and I'm not sure if I read this yet but it says as the old saying goes you can't bottle happiness wrong Gabby Gallo drank that bottled happiness and won't be feeling bored or lonely for a while so I think that's pretty good I'm not sure I feel like I've read that though <laughs> maybe maybe not I know I read uh, this one a shot of liquid that makes you forget your troubles who knew so I thought I turned off oh whoa 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 whoa, whoa. were those zombies were those zombies oh damn it I'm too late <laughs> I guess we shall see. It was an okay hunt for Jake Heron. He found gold. Okay. Are you crazy? That's amazing. Who, like, wouldn't want to find gold? That's insane. Alright, I'm kind of nervous for the whole... What the heck is Latte doing? She, I can hear her doing something. Who else is going over here? Are they crazy? This ghost just wants to die again, doesn't he or she... Do ghosts die again? So he's visiting the graveyard um, on a full moon, which is what he wanted to do. And then over here, there's a pond that I'm going to make him skip rocks in. And look at that fish. I think that's a death fish, is it? Stay up past bedtime. What is your bedtime? I don't even know what's your bedtime. Oh, your sim wants to stay up past 11 p.m.? Um... What the hell? He's a night owl. Of course he's going to stay up past 11 p.m. Yeah. Oh, he's skipping stones. And he's terrible at it. That's embarrassing. I skip stones. I'm pretty good at it. <laughs> I'm tooting my own horn. Is this a zombie? Oh my god. It's a zombie. Is it? Oh, it's a werewolf. Damn it. That sucks. So what the hell is a werewolf doing? Where are the zombies at? Is that a zombie? What is that? Oh, that's a rock. <laughs> wow. I'm stupid. Um, okay, well, there's no zombies here. Where the hell are the zombies? Are they at home? I'm not sure. I mean, it'd be pretty crazy if they were just waiting for us. Rawr. I want to see them get pummeled by one of these pea shooter, pea shooter things. I don't see any zombies at all. What the hell? Maybe 
because it's the first full moon and it's the very first day, you have to wait for the zombies to come. Uh, where's the zombies? I want a zombie attack. I want to get attacked by a zombie. Come on. Come on. Is this a zombie? That's not a zombie. Wow. When do zombies come? I'm assuming maybe it's around 10 then. Let's go over to this house. Maybe this house has zombies. <laughs> I'm on a zombie hunt. I'm going to be a zombie killer. Actually, that would be pretty neat if I could kill some zombies in here. I'm pretty sure everybody would be really happy if you did that. How are you going to... Oh, man. You should go to the grocery store and, and get some plasma free. I'm going to have him go to like raid the grocery store. So we could go ahead and steal some stuff and then also purchase some fruit. Well, no, I'll just have him steal stuff. Let's see how that works. Oops. Crap, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, how cute is this little liquor store? Oh, that's adorable. Grocery store. Uh, Raid Everfresh Delights Supermarket. Oh, it's a supermarket. Whatever. It looks like a pretty decent sized like, diner slash grocery store. Like something that you'd see... Uh, going on a road trip, you know, you just stop in the middle of somewhere and it's, it, <laughs> I don't know if that makes sense. Or maybe it's because we're like all the way over here in the middle of nowhere. There aren't any zombies. Do zombies just come out of the ground? I'm just waiting for a zombie to attack. Is that bad? It's probably bad. <laughs> you, little one, should probably actually hunt some more. Maybe you can get a hunting, hunting yeah. skill. Gabby just learned a recipe for Flask of Sleep. It was an okay hunt for Jake Heron. He found gold. I already read that. Okay, you can go to bed now. Uh, send an elixir to a friend. Oh, you could send them. Collect a gem during a full moon. <gasps> Reach level 4 of alchemy skill. Yes. For sure. Um, ew, what is that? Oh my god, what is that? What is that? Oh, I'm gonna have her wake up and catch that. That looks cool. Hopefully she can harvest this mushroom soon. Why does she look so creepy? <gasps> she looks really creepy. What's wrong with her skin tone? It looks kind of green. She looks almost sick. Poor thing. She must be. And then you can go back to sleep. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I woke you. And you, Lana, are you going to go to bed? You're, you're a little tired. So let's have you go into your little fairy den. Say, ooh, drink pollen punch. And then we'll, we'll, we'll go to sleep. Drink some pollen punch, Lana. I want to see what that looks like. And where the hell are the zombies? Who knows where the zombies are? Gabby just caught a light beetle. Valued at 37 simoleons. An uncommon find. Nice. Well, I don't want to give it to anybody or sell it or anything. Because we could put it in potions. Or elixirs. Whatever. Oh, turn into a fairy and go. <gasps> you hear that? That is so cute. Bah, this plasma fruit is all bruised. I should check the organic section. <laughs> okay. I hope that clerk doesn't call the cops. I hate getting arrested. It was another... I already... Why do I keep reading that? If only Vampire Council would approve plasma-flavored tofu, I wouldn't have to resort to such measures. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's, the, it's funny, the things that they say. <gasps> what is that? Oh, ooh. Okay, can you catch these? Catch these. Catch these fireflies. Don't you stare at me, silly baby in a shopping cart. God, you're such an ass. <laughs> and where the hell are the zombies? I'm kind of sad there aren't any zombies. Hmm. Hmm, is that a ghost I saw over there? I don't know. Alright, I'm going to check the graveyard one more time. I just assume that there isn't a zombie attack because... Like, I just started this Let's Play today. Like, they just moved into town, and usually you have to wait a couple sim days for everybody to get situated, for all the mixology of people to go into their bars, like, for late night, and, um, I, you know, stuff like that, for everybody to get their jobs. Ooh, whose house is this? Whoa, this is nice. Is this, um, one of the fancy houses? Fancy people houses? The Ivy House. Holy crap, that's ginormous. We gotta become friends with them. I wanna see what's on the inside. I should have made him a kleptomaniac. Why didn't I think of that? Yep, you're thirsty. You can go to bed now. You can go home. Well, at least he stayed out past 11. There's no zombies, though. This is so disappointing. <laughs> oh, does anybody else have this problem? Or do you guys know where I can find some zombies? I would love to find some zombies. I mean, I got a pea shooter and everything and a walnut. But I guess not. 
Wanna go to sleep, you cute little fairy thing, you. Oh, you're so cute. And Jake has to go to the bathroom. You could just do that and shower, and then I guess you could go to bed, sleep. Oh, I feel so bad for everyone. They all have to. Well, I mean, not really. Poor Jake. He doesn't like it. He doesn't like turning into a werewolf. Maybe he'll grow to love it, though. He has to. I mean, his his lifetime goal is to be leader of the pack, which is to turn by werewolves and collect 40,000 simoleons worth of freaking items. It's, it's insane. It's insane. Are there any zombies over here? I'm sorry if you can hear any pounding. They're cutting down a tree, or they're like collecting a tree that fell over on my grandma's balcony. It's not even funny. I don't know why I'm laughing. But, um... Crumple Bottom. <gasps> Crumple Bottom! No way. No way. We have to visit them. We have got to visit them one day. Tomorrow. I'll try to make a note of it. The Ivy House and the Crumple Bottoms. And do you hear that? That dreaded noise? Oi. Eat something raw. Ew. Collect three gems. Okay. So. What else is there to do today? I'm not sure. I'm going to record another Let's Play after this because I'm just, I'm super excited to, to play this. And why didn't you catch these? Punk. Catch those. And then you can go to sleep. I'll let you sleep then. Sleep. You. What the hell are you doing, Lana? I told you to go to bed. You stupid fairy. <laughs> sleep. Oh. Wait. Energized by moonlight. Lunacy. You don't have to be a werewolf to feel the effects of the full moon. Even a normal sim can start feeling a little loony. Tranquil. Nothing can stress or anger sims who have reached their happy place from freaking out. <laughs> Energized by moonlight. Maybe that's why she can't sleep. I should make her and, and this guy stay up throughout the day. Also, they need to get a computer, so we have got to get them to their job soon. They need the money, like, bad. We need at least one computer. I'll put it in here. I'll put it right here if I can if I can fit it right there. That'd be nice. Alright, so he's going to catch this. There were no zombies today. I'll leave the the lunar cycle at two days, so hopefully next time um we'll be able to see some zombies. I really want to see some zombies. I don't know why. I mean can't they kill us? <laughs> They probably can kill us, and I'm all excited to watch everyone die. No, that's that's sad. I'm just kidding. Um, and then maybe Gabby can turn them into zombies and fix them. And she also needs to learn the sunscreen elixir so she could give it to give it to Cal. That'd be great. Uh, so I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Stay tuned for next time when you know. I just hope we have zombies. All right, and then that way I could change the lunar cycle back to normal, back to six days. I believe was a norm, the normal one. And we can get them on track, get them making money, get them starting to turn people over the town. Ugh, this, this Let's Play is going to be, I don't want to say epic, because I don't really like using that word. I don't really know how to use it, but epic. <laughs> so have a great day, guys. Let me know if you enjoyed this video. Feedback is greatly appreciated. And I will talk to you soon. Bye, guys.